Hey guys, it's Kugel again with another video and uh, this time I've got a tutorial for how to get G apps working in Marshmallow ROM, so stay tuned for that. So guys, the uh, Marshmallow ROMs are right now coming along and uh, it's been about two months, uh, about more than a one month since the Marshmallow ROMs have been released. And the thing that uh, really, really gets my nerve is that the GF package are still not working properly, but that has mainly to do with how Android handles permissions on the new Marshmallow. So that is the main problem behind the GF packages flashed problem. So yeah, I'm just going to tell you guys a neat little trick which I had I had uh, seen on a forum which does really seem to work out. So that's something which I want to share with you guys. So let's get started now. I have already wiped my phone. I don't have anything. I have already done a factory reset. Now I'll be installing a ROM which is like uh, this is called the AOS IP ROM which I have already done the video review of which you'll be seeing soon. So yeah, uh, it does not have uh, G apps package now the what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys two methods I'll be using banks the G apps package because that is the one which I found to be uh, Working on both the methods. So that is something which I really really appreciate uh, It does work on uh, both of them. So that is really nice And yeah, I'll be providing the link in the description below so that you can check that out too so guys, I do have the Marshmallow ROM uh, flash right now. I have flashed the AOS IP ROM and I am pretty good to go with it. Now, first of the methods. Now this method doesn't require you to do anything. I mean literally nothing. Uh, after you flash the ROM without rebooting and getting into the ROM, flash the G apps because that should work. Uh, the way this works is that when you flash it along with the ROM, uh, when the phone starts up for the first time, it does a lot of permission management and all that. And all of these system applications which are already there uh, will be created uh, with the permissions which is required. So you won't get any problems with the Setup Wizard or Play Store uh, Play services not working correctly. So I'll be rebooting the system and I'll show you guys that this is working. And uh, yeah, this also blew my mind first time, but now I understand why it is. So I'll be showing you guys. So as you can see, it is now optimizing everything, uh, including the G apps and the system application. So in this process, it will set the permissions by itself. That's the main problem with the G app. So I'll be showing you guys uh, another method where you have everything uh, already set up, but you don't, you're not willing to uh, clear that out for just G app. So I'll be all, I'll also be showing you guys that. So yeah. So as you can see, this does work out, and uh, I am able to input my signatures and uh, uh, credential into it. And yeah, this does work, and I am really really appreciating this that it is working. Uh, I can actually go into settings menu after I skip through this one, and uh, it should it should probably work. So yeah. So as you can see, I am inside the system and I have already flashed the G apps and Play Store and all of these are working. There's no problems concerning uh, the uh, G apps issues of having problems with it. Now, I'll be showing you guys how to get the G apps working once you have already set up your ROM and you are planning to uh, flash the G apps after some time, which, well, may many people may not go for. But I will be still showing you guys how to do that. So yeah. So guys, I have now flashed the G apps uh, without G apps, the AOS IP ROM without G apps. So you can see there are no G apps person. There are nothing uh, sort of Play Store is not available. So I haven't flashed G apps right now. I will be now flashing G apps that is by G apps from the recovery right now, and we'll show you guys how to get the force close issues solved so yeah so as you guys can see i have already flashed the gf package and it's now optimizing those gf packages after which we will get a lot of fc issues of uh, two things uh, first is the uh, setup wizard uh, closes and also play store will get you fc issues so i'll be showing you guys how to get past that so as you can see i am starting to get the setup wizard stop uh, fc issues and um, I can't go any further rather than just stare at the screen. So this is a problem which I'm facing with uh, a lot of uh, the GApps packages available. So what you can do for that is swipe down, go to notification drawer, get to settings in any way possible. After you get to settings, you can go on to applications in the apps page. After you have uh, selected uh, the show system applications, you will be able to see all the applications here. Now, what you need to do is go and select Setup Wizard, 
in that in permissions this is the problem which is causing it you need to enable both these permissions and the FC issues for setup, setup wizard is will now be gone so you will not have FC issues from setup wizard now for the play services you need to navigate to that select permissions the location permission permission is already enabled you need to enable all the other permissions and yeah play services that does take a lot of permissions and now hopefully you will not have the problems of uh, play services having an FC issue either so that is the way you get play services play store services working with this ROM so I hope you guys understand now how to get play services working uh, on a marshmallow ROM after you have set up the ROM now uh, this is this may not even apply to you guys because if you are going to flash the uh, G apps package along with the ROM that will be much easier for you guys you don't need to do any of these voodoo magic stuff so that should be much easier so yeah uh, I just got about I got to know about this uh, little trick so I wanted you guys to know about this because I have been banging my head against the wall because I want to use the AOS IP ROM as the daily driver on this device but I was not able to get GFs and I am dependent on uh, Gmail and Google Keep so yeah that is it hope you guys like the video please share subscribe and like the video if you found it useful see you guys next time bye